is very loud. What? At least my face is looking a little better. Roderick, it's the White Hills. They're assembling in the courtyard. Um. They've woken the house. You can't let this go on. They want to see us cower in our own house. What in damnation are they doing? They just showed up here, started banging their shields. I'll need my sentinel. Go ahead, Talia, and have Duncan meet me in the courtyard. He's not back from the wall yet. Ah! Then make sure Royland's there. See, even if I picked Royland, I would still... What, I'm controlling? No, I'm not controlling this. What do you want? What is this? It's a parade of dead men if I have my way. <gasps> you burned a cart. This is... Minor arson? <laughs> I'm controlling this, aren't I? What is the meaning of this? I demand to know! <laughs> Those are strong words. For a cripple who can't carry a sword? You must be Griff. All of you. Man, you look like an asshole. Show respect to Griff Whitehill. Fourth born son of Lord Ludd Whitehill and commander of this garrison. Why are you burning stuff? Cocky Roderick, we used to call you. Swinging your prick round. Lording it over my family. Now look at you. Hey? Roderick the Ruined. I hardly recognize you, but the name fits, don't it? I don't think it'll <laughs> stick. Pathetic. Get your men out of my sight. This is absurd. That sounds like the old Roderick beating his chest every chance he got. I don't think he gets it. No, my lord. I don't think he does. Roiland, well, stab him quickly! You bite your tongue. I am in charge now. And the first thing you need to know is that if I am not happy, no one is happy. So my men are taking over your great hall. That's where we'll quarter from now on. Roiland, stab oh, him! You can't. You'll have to go through me. I won't have my men sleeping out in your barn in shit and filth. Maybe that's how foresters live, but not us. I don't care if you're happy or not. You'll quarter where I tell you. I wasn't fucking asking, Roderick. And what's more, you will treat my men right. I've heard what you've done, pushing wine on them, turning them into drunkards. That ends now. I'm not here to keep them in line. I'm here to keep you in line. If you don't like it, go home. If you don't like it here, you can march them back to High Point. Watch yourself, Roderick. This is against the King's law. You've no right to make such demands. I have every right. We're here under the orders of Roos Bolton, Warden of the North. I am taking every opportunity so to stab this guy. Walls. I will be in your courtyard. I will sit on your fucking council and be in your bedchambers if I bloody well please. You can't do this, little bastard. You can't just do whatever- We do what we were sent here to do. You're mad, Griff. This is my house and you will do as I say. Why should I listen to some cripple with half a face? Now, me and my men will take our place in your hall. Unless you think you and your army can stop me. Spit! Spit in his face! No. Fuck this guy! You know better than that. You know where we'll be. This is outrageous. Roderick! You can't let them do this! I am not going to. You can't to. go in there. We can and we will. Unless you want this all to end right now. Eh? I'm the only lord here. Come on. This game already pulled one stab on a main character. I'm not betting they'll do it again. Griff Whitehill. That's not those fourth born. Parading in here like a conquering fucking hero. It was bad enough when it was just the soldiers. Whoa! You're getting you awful close to me. <laughs> Soiling our house. I know you tried to stop them, my lord. But this occupation will break our people if it drags on. That's clearly what he wants. 
We can't let that scut rule this house. I'm no fool. I've seen the soldiers in our holes. And Whitehill's runt is at the front of the pack. So don't act as if I don't know how bad it is. Of course not, my lord. But Griff Whitehill Whoa. is at the beginning of <laughs> I our thought there would be animation or the end of them. We need to look at all the pieces. Whitehill men aren't just in our house. They've raided our lands, burnt farms, and cut down our trees. All the way from here to High Point. How do we kill a snake, then? By smashing its head. Griff is in the head. It's his father. Perhaps. But Griff is here. We have access to him. And they have Ryan. He carved these soldiers himself. Brandon? That's actually pretty Bing good. Whitehill may have told you at the funeral. Who knows what horrors they're putting him through? Held prisoner at High Point. You can't forsake his safety. But we have to do something. My lord, at least give us a target to aim for. I'm really not sure where this is going, where they're going with this. They might, we might be making a prisoner out of Griff, though. Um, what? Save Ryan or expel Griff. I'm picking expel Griff. Fuck this. We have to push Griff and his soldiers out of Ironrath. They're the most immediate threat. But Roderick, what of Ryan? If you move against Griff, who knows what those wretches will do to my son? Knowing the White Hills, speak true. Would you give up this house? But your brother! We must secure Ironrath, so we have a home to bring Ryan back to. Don't forget him. Then, it's decided. We take back our home. We lost most of our men with Gregor at the Twins. We can probably gather another 30 or 40 men. But the Whitals are already fortified inside Ironrath. Thankfully, Roderick secured an alliance with the Glenmores. But those forces mean nothing until after the marriage. Time for a wedding! We have to count on Asher and Mira. How? How would Asher we count on to Mira? Sail home from Essos with a company of hardened sellswords. But they're not bannermen. We'll need to pay them for it. Which is why Mira's part to play is just as crucial. She can get us the coin we need in King's Landing. You don't imagine we have the luxury of waiting for them. Asher and Mira are a long way from here. I have faith in my children. I don't think Lud Whitehall will kindly stand by while we pull ourselves together. Our very lives and the future of House Forrester are at stake. We have to let them try. It's the only way. Then we hold fast. The White Hills aren't ready for war. It won't be long before you're able to take action yourself. Well, one way or another, there's a fight brewing. So I have much to prepare, and men to train. My lord? I'm really not sure what... My lord. What the immediate there future is. something we can do now. A voice from High Point, Gwyn Whitehill. I spoke with her at the funeral. As did I, and she's willing to meet. Away from her father's guards. I hope you trust me enough as Sentinel to consider this. To consider what? It would what? be wise to hear what she has to say. Arrange a meeting. Sure, whatever. What she has whatever. to say may prove useful. I believe she can be trusted. But best use caution nonetheless. Of course. And I'll make sure no one else knows. For now at least. Good. Handle things right with Gwyn. And she may even help us in High Point when the time comes. <sighs> I want the dove pie served with a spoon of lemon cream. We'll have to let the kitchens know. And these flowers, they're just all wrong in the Crown Lands. Mira, are you listening to me? Lady Marjorie, good tidings to you today. 
Thank you, Lord Tyrion. And you, Lady Mira. A word in private, if I may. I'll return her shortly. Who would I be to deny Lord Tyrion? Ah, good. Very soon goody. you'll be the queen. And if you're anything like the current one, you'll deny me all you like. Ah! Mira, please excuse me for a moment, my lady. Yes. I promise I won't keep you long. I don't think Lady Marjorie likes me. Although after tonight, I suspect I won't be her least favorite Lannister anymore. <laughs> what did you want, my lord? Oh, there's much unpleasant business to be done today. But I bring you a bit of good news. I've arranged for the crown to purchase for a yeah. Family. A royal decree sits on my desk now. And I'll have my squire Podrick see to it at the first opportunity. You'll bring prosperity to your family. They're lucky to have you. You honor me, Lord Tyrion. Only you could make such a strong gesture to House Forrester. My lord, do I still owe you a favor? As handmaiden to the new queen, you will undoubtedly prove useful. I'm sure I'll think of something. Ah! Uh, Enjoy the festivities. This Goodbye. is tough because I'm not a handmaiden to the queen if Marjorie get, kicks me out. I think Marjorie will keep me around, but I'm not sure. Ah! Day of all days. You know I didn't want you talking to him. You're playing a dangerous game. He wanted to talk to me. He he came on to me, okay? Sarah will help me with my gown and hair. But... I'll deal with you after the wedding. Okay. Oh, Sarah I'm wanted to Sarah. meet boys. In the meantime. Look, I know Marjorie is in jail at the end of season five. In uh, spiritual jail. Garrett. Oh, jeez. No. Sorry. Whoa, don't kill him yet, Thanks man. Just... For the watch. Keeping at the ready. That's good. Don't lose that. I understand your uncle paid you a visit. What did he want? Not many people pass through here. What brought him this far? He was just delivering ironwood shields for the Night's Watch. Good. Our stocks are running low. I know it couldn't be easy seeing him, but you have to leave all that behind. Especially now that you're a ranger. Aye. I know you had told me you could stand with these men, but not every brother's a friend. If it came to it, and you were in trouble north of the wall, any of them you'd trust by your side. I'd trust You know him. these men. Who do you want watching your back? Finn can handle himself. I'd bring him to a fight. I'm glad you can trust your brother. I'll remember him. Herald Holt of White Harbor, Corlys Wells from Stony Sept. And finally, we've got more spawn of nobility joining us. No. Brit Warwick of House Whitehill. Oh! Be. House Whitehill. Sure this one's lights. for the Boltons. Gary. Gary, what's the master? You know him. He killed my Come family. On. Get moving. Gary, who is he? That man murdered my family. What? Snow! See these new recruits to the maester. Don't do something you'll regret. Uh, I'm not gonna get revenge. If it isn't the fucking pig farmer. I'm here because of you. Got sent to the wall for that little party I do with your family. Don't think it's over. Best watch your back. What are you waiting for, recruit? Welcome to the wall. Brother, looking forward to it. That's enough. I said move. I'll be seeing you, farm boy. I may stab him. Oh boy. This isn't fair. We were supposed to be up there. I'll never see another wedding like this. No, you Don't won't. You <laughs> Cersei want to punish you. But it never should have affected me like this. I'm so sorry. 
I had no idea any of this would happen. The but choices are getting Lance harder. I will give the game that. We have saved my family. I hope that's true, Mira. I really do. Because you don't know how furious Marjorie is at you. When I was getting her dressed for the wedding, she was... Oh my goodness! She could replace you with. <gasps> I probably shouldn't have even told you. Tell me who it is. Oh, no, I didn't, I didn't mean to click that! Sarah? It doesn't matter. It was just names. This is about you. I know this must be hard for you. It wasn't too long ago I was asking for your help with Marjorie. And what did you do? Uh, what did now I you do? you know how it feels. Being on the outside looking in. But I'm your friend, Mira. Always. If you want my help with Marjorie, just ask. Otherwise, Marjorie's going to make you leave King's Landing. You're pushing her to it, Mira. Sarah, I was wrong not to offer you my help. I can only ask you to be a better friend than I was to you. Don't worry. We'll figure this out. I'll beg Marjorie if I have to. I'm not letting her send you home. I could be of use to Sarah, after all. Serving the pie. Oi. We're missing everything. I know you. No! You were in the gardens the other night with Damien. Ah! Uh. Before he disappeared. I have a few questions to ask you. What were you doing there with him? Mira? So what if I was with him? Uh. Seven hells. <sighs> you there, girl. I need a towel or a wet cloth, something. Lord Morgren. You'll need to find someone else. I'm not finished with her. Are you sick, man? You think I have time to bother with handmaidens? Release her or I'll have Queen Cersei find you another job. Snootiness for the win! This isn't over, handmaiden. Um, I'm alone. <laughs> well, I just ruined a perfectly good shirt to come to your rescue. No need to explain what that was all about. We all have our own mischief to hide. That was kind of you. I do appreciate it. Well, I didn't do it merely for your benefit. Then why? Perhaps I recognize a kindred spirit. Or someone who it's owes not you. every little handmaiden who can steal an ironwood decree with the crown right out from under my nose. Oh, that's right. I remember Consider you Consider me impressed. My partners, I am afraid to say, felt rather differently about it. You flatter me, my lord. <laughs> I'm only saying you have potential, my lady. Your problem is, you still think like a handmaiden. Do you even understand why Tyrion gave you the Ironwood deal? Nope! Because it wasn't out of the kindness of his heart. I'm no fool. He wants something from me. Access to Marjorie. Or, perhaps he just knew he could get the cheapest diamond from me. Very observant. You are no mere handmaid. But you need to stop thinking like that! I remember what it was like to be new to this game. You feel like you're drowning, don't you? But there's no one you can really trust. What you need, more than anything, is an ally. I could be that for you, Lady Mira. Is that something you'd be interested in? What are and you what term? exactly are the terms of this offer? What do you get out of it? A smart question. So, let me be blunt. Circumstances have put us at odds. But what if we were to work together? Control the price of Ironwood together? We could get very, very rich together. Oh, money! Or Her eyes lit up at that. Should I go back to Lord Whitehall, who has proven to be very interested in it? Oh, I want to see it! Oh, 
What happened? Joffrey's dead! I'm afraid it just became a very bad time to be linked to Tyrion Lannister. Tell me that you got that Ironwood decree from him before the wedding. Oh no. He said it was waiting for me on his desk. <sighs> what a shame. Such potential. I'm afraid any chance of our alliance has become quite impossible. What if I steal you it? understand. Lady Mira. I can get it. I'll get it back from his chamber. That would not be an easy task. Especially now. But if it were to disappear, perhaps we could talk again. You have a good head for business, Lady Mira. It'd be terribly disappointing to see it on the end of a pike. <sighs> no! Why did you go to that specific place? Um, why would I knock? Listen first. It's locked. <gasps> Not getting in this way. Tom! What in seven hells do you think you're doing up here? What are you thinking? You've got to leave. Now. Tom, I'm in trouble. There's something inside I need to get. If I don't, it's going to be a nightmare. Damn it. Whatever trouble you're in could be trouble for me too. Could you? So what do we do? <sighs> I have an idea. The terrace. He's assassin screening it. I could maybe climb across the roof and drop down onto the outside terrace. It's just... Oh, I don't know, Mira. Is whatever's in there really worth risking my life for? Tom, I really need your help here. I can't do this alone. Just be careful. Wait here. I'll be at the door before you know it. I trust that he's a faceless. He can do this. Also, he's still a main character in episode 5, apparently, so... Just what do you think you're doing here? You shouldn't be anywhere near this place. I'm sorry. I was just... I'm leaving right now. Not so fast. I'm not going to ask you again. Whoever's in there, I command you to open this door at once, in the name of the king! You, don't move. Uh. Tom, it's me, hurry! Gods, that was close. I almost didn't make it back down here. Some tiles on the roof came loose. I almost lost my footing. Thank you, Tom. I could never have done this without you. We don't have time I'm for a reflection. Of paper. A royal decree. Well, go on. That Lannister guard could be back with help any second. Come on, hurry up! Watch outside the door. Tom! You can do this. This is so intense. Desk. Uh, he said it was sitting on a desk. Desk. Come on. Gotta get it. He said that it would be on his desk. Um, Mira, we're running out of time. Starbucks parchment. Yes, is it the parchment? Oh, nothing. Just a letter from Tywin Lannister. Royal decree. Oh, oh another bloody letter. To Tom? Come on, Mira. Ah, uh, no. Tyrion, you do not have a good. Battleaxe use! My goodness. Um. I think someone's coming. Uh, Alright. Or right, they've gone. History of the Northern Ball. Oh, you don't have time for this. So they must be in the strong box then. Are you almost done? Stop brushing me. They're going to bloody kill us if we don't get out of here. Ledger, her strong box. 
Has to be strongbox. Tyrion strongbox. Oh, it must be in here. I think the Lannister guard is back. Oh no, it's the other one. Damn it! Hide. I'll find a way to distract them. Ah. I'm telling you, I heard someone in here. Search the place. We'll find them. And after. Now that we've got the imp's keys, we can have a little look inside his lockboxes, eh? <laughs> Aye. Oh my god! I can't take this. I cannot take this. <laughs> Help! Fire! What the hell? Damn it! Call oh. boy for the win! The keys. It's gotta be in the strong box. You did it. How? Don't I ask how, just do it. The hall. I bought you a minute, maybe two. Oh, thank you. Did you find it? Oh, I think I think it has to be in here. It has to be. Oh, my goodness. Okay, I only have a second, which it's this one. No, 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 no. Just hurry. Um. Oh. Come on. Neck. Yes! Haha! <laughs> Next time on Game of Thrones.